Hey, 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 this is Kurt the Boat Doctor. Out here, uh, 160 Hughes Craft. Yeah, I believe uh, the top speed on this thing was about 30 uh, with the tide and about 25 against the tide. It should go down at one pitch on the prop. It's an F50 inline four cylinder uh, stainless prop shaft, drive shaft, internal zincs, external zincs, four cylinder, uh, nine nines, two cylinder, uh, 11 by seven. That one's okay on that one, but profit down I was only hitting 54 trimmed up uh, it's a 2014 uh, the depth finders not in it and these notes I'm giving you are just things that is why I bring these out to check everything so they can get fixed or the salesman can come to you and say hey uh, hey well that didn't work well yeah you know do you really need it it's kind of like that but the major things we always want to fix but it's certain little things like <clears throat> Uh, it was missing an old GPS or something. You didn't want it anyway. That's something that they need to let you know. But anyway, the depth finder is not here. The customer says he has it. The wiper doesn't work. That's right here. Okay, uh, wash down does work, but it has no hose. The tie downs are here. Uh, no drain plug. It does have downrigger uh, plugs and pads, but no downrigger. So sometimes the person doesn't give the downriggers. The top's a little moldy. They should clean that. I didn't see a backdrop, but I do see a slope that goes clean to the back of the boat and no rod holders either. Or it, it has um, the mounts, but no holders. Uh, boat runs good. The 50 runs good. The kicker runs good. Uh, single battery. And back storage up into here. Uh, fuel gauge. It was full tank of gas. Uh, the horn works. These courtesies and these are open. Unless one of these is for the depth finder. The, and the 12 volt power point right here. It's a cable steer. Um, so we'll go back here. And that little kicker motor was about eight to six miles an hour. Single battery, no water leaks in back. Got the mini micron Yamaha. Change that thing once a year, no matter what, and stick with the Yamaha. Okay, so the kicker motor, just trim her down like this. Okay, when it's cold, you gotta pull the choke out. And sometimes if you let it sit for a month, you gotta put this into gear. And then throttle it like this, full throttle like three, four times, and then bring it back. And it always got to be a neutral or it won't start. And then you want to start it where it says right there where that line is. So you just hit it and then bring it down. So once you fire it up in the morning, it should be good to go. So I'm going to just tilt it at this angle with this friction like this so it holds it. And open it up, make sure I'm not going to hit nothing. Now I can steer it with that without a tie bar. Trim your main motor down. See, I have no tie bar on that. Okay. So now that way, if I got a fish on, then all I have to do is go back here. And then I, I got my throttle, I got my shift. Put it in reverse. It goes good, good water flow. Put that, kills right there. Trim it up. Then on the 50 horse, should be fuel injected. Uh, right here's your, up underneath here's your swivel for your seat. Just turn the key. And we're gonna hit it, straighten it up. Now if you take off, like say here, and the wheel wants to take, trim it up until that wheel stops. There. So that way when I hit it, how it ain't taking off on me. About three seconds to plane. Planing about 4,000 RPM, about 20 miles an hour. Cruising about 25, about 4,500 right there. Full throttle. Start trimming it. And we're only doing uh, 54, got 414 hours. So I definitely pitch it down one. And that's all she wrote. 2014 160 Hughes Craft. I mean, all in all, everything's good. Just some simple little fixes. Uh, so, good job. Boat Doctor out.